Oh, man. All right, all right. Ha. Ha. All right, right who's next? Great. It'll be a hundred years before... It looks like this is Ospio. It's so gloomy and damp here. It's giving me the chills, too. It's because the city is in a cavern. I wonder if the lack of sun drives the people here to do shady things, like stealing Blastia cores. May I see your passport, please? Our... passport? This is an Imperial facility. We can't just let anyone inside, can we? Passport? You don't have one of those, do you? An associate of ours is inside. Could you please let us through? If you filled out the official visitation paperwork, then you ought to have gotten your passport from this associate of yours. This is the first we've heard, though. If you won't let us in, perhaps you could call him to the gate for us? What's your associate's name? Mordio. M mordio We can't help you. You'll need to mail in a request and have a passport officially issued to you. Damn. Don't budge an inch, do you? Excuse me, but did a knight by the name of Flynn happen to stop by here? All information about the establishment is classified. We cannot share even small details with outsiders. So you can't even tell me why Flynn was here? No, of course not. So what you're saying is that Flynn really did come here? Um, I don't know who you're talking about. A knight named Flynn? Never heard of him. Could we at least leave him a message? Give it up, Estelise. We'd have more luck asking a brick wall for help. Let's just go. But Flynn's inside. What? We're just gonna give up? I'm not going to give up. I'm going to see Flynn. And I'm gonna take back that Blastia from that thief Mordio and give him a beating he won't forget. So can't we look for another way in? Of course we can. Let's take a stroll around, why don't we? As a last resort, maybe we could go over the walls. like this never open when you want them to. I guess we'll have to climb over the wall and open it from the inside. A little quick to jump to our last resort, aren't you? Let's wait for Flynn to come out then. Even if Flynn comes out, it's not like he's gonna bring Mordio out with him. Well, if Flynn comes outside, we can just ask him to let us in, can't we? He'd never go for a plan like this. He's far too much of a goody-goody. Carol, what are you doing? There! It's open! Huh? You can't do that! Your guild specializes in hunting monsters, right? Or are you guys into thieves' guild type stuff too? <laughs> um, yeah, well, I'm pretty much the only one who can do anything like this. Well, good job. Shall we? No, that's bad. We should just wait here for Flynn. 
I don't have the patience to wait for Flynn to just happen to walk out of this town by chance. It was unquestioning obedience to laws and authority in times like this that made me quit the Imperial Knights in the first place. But, but... Well then, Estelle, keep a lookout here for us, won't you? Wait, but, but, um... I'm going with you. Man, there are a lot of Mordio lookalikes here, aren't there? Excuse me, do you have a minute? Well, what do you want? Would you happen to know if a knight named Flynn Shifo has come through here? Flynn? Oh, that guy. He was saying something about going to catch someone who'd been vandalizing ruins. Where is he now? I couldn't say. My research keeps me too busy to pay attention to things like that. I... I see. I'm sorry to interrupt you. I'll be taking my leave then. Hey, wait up. Tell me one more thing. Is there a famed mage named Mordio around here? Yeah, there are people who want to see that weird... So I was right. You know Mordio? No, uh, I don't know anything at all. I don't associate with people like that. Hey, I'm not done yet. What? What is it? Tell me where the mage is. Mordio lives alone in a shack back that way. Go and see for yourself if you want. Thanks. Are you sure about this? Hmm? Everyone seems to get all out of sorts just from hearing that guy's name. Yeah. Doesn't it bother you? Well, he's a blast, you thief. It's no wonder people don't like him. You know, Yuri, your attitude, your behavior, they don't seem very... knightly. Where'd that come from? I mean, we're entering the city through a back entrance, like thieves. This coming from the guy who picked the lock. I'm just tagging along to find Flynn, and now you've turned me into a thief! We haven't stolen anything! Sheesh! Keep out. Seriously. Mordio. I guess this is the place. I think people usually try knocking first. Looks like no one's home. What should we do? No point in hesitating when you're heading into a den of thieves. No, I don't want us to commit any more crimes. I guess that means it's my turn then. What? Your turn? We shouldn't do that either. Nothing to it! Wait for me! Please, wait! Why does he always do that? place like this you can pretty much live anywhere you can eat and sleep if you set your mind to it Yuri don't you have something to say first uh hello we're coming in and the door Carol here open your door sorry about that honestly Yuri excuse us is anyone home it's a good thing no one's here that means we get to look for evidence This city sure has a lot of books. I'm not really too crazy about reading, and I have a hard time sleeping in this place. Yeah, 
You seem like you're too jittery to sit still and look at something for too long. You're one to talk. Hey, what happened to Estelle? She's been over there reading books ever since we got here. Hmm. Estelle, time to get going. Hmm. When she starts reading, you can't pull her away. Huh? Did you say something? This seems to be literature from an ancient civilization. She's not even listening. Shut up. Huh? Hey, hold on! Thieves? No, what are you... Wait! Be gone! Help! <laughs> uh, why me? A girl? If you can pull tricks like that, why'd you bother skipping town back in Zafius? Huh? Skipping town? Why would I need to skip town? For stealing the core of a Blastia from the lower quarter in the capital. What else? What? You're calling me a thief. Have you ever heard of common sense? Sure. So you break into a home, call the owner a thief, and wave a sword in their face. What the hell kind of sense? Hey, dog! You stay back, you... you dog! And you, kid! Give him back! What do you mean? The Blastia! The Blastia! Give him back to me! What's with you? My name is Esteliz. We're terribly sorry for barging in on you like this. Yuri, Carol, you too. Sorry. So? What do you want? Well, you see, Yuri has followed a Blastia thief here all the way from the Imperial capital. And? And that Blastia thief wore a cape, was short, and their name was Mordio. So? Hmm. Well, Mordio is certainly my name. Rita Mordio, to be exact. And the height matches up, too! What do you have to say for yourself? I told you, I have no idea what you're... Oh, I hadn't thought of that. Follow me. What? Uh, maybe you didn't hear me. We're not finished here. Just follow me, would you? There's talk that some thieves have turned up in the Shikos ruins. Thieves? Are you sure about that? It came from an Imperial Knight who asked me for help. It should be trustworthy. Do you think that knight might have been Flynn? It's gotta be. Looks like she shot him down, though. Hey, remember what that guy outside said about someone vandalizing the ruins? Which means the thief who stole the Blastia core could be there. Hmm. Finished chatting? Let's go. All right, but don't even think of making a break for it. You don't have to come. If you want, I'll just call the guards. Why don't we give it a try? It sounds like Flynn might even be there. It's up to you. Go to jail, make a run for it, or follow me. Pick one. Okay, okay. We'll go with you. The Shikos ruins are even further to the east, once you leave the city. Rita's a little scary, huh? Really? She's about what I'd expect. Seems like she's in a crappy mood, too.
That's because you broke into her house, Yuri. I don't exactly feel like being on my best behavior when I'm dealing with a core thief. What will you do if you're wrong about her? If I'm wrong, I'll apologize. You'd better remember that when the time comes. Oh, were you listening? I just happened over here. So you think I'm scary, do you? Watch it, Carol. She's definitely the kind to hold a grudge. Hey! D don't scare me like that! Your name is Estelise, right? Yes, but that's kind of long to say easily. Please call me Estelle. You look like some fancy noble Estelise. Why are you with that jerk? Oh, I think that Yuri is a good person. And really, I don't mind if you call me Estelle. All right, Estelise. She's tough. These are the Shikos ruins. It looks like there aren't any Imperial Knights around. These footprints are still fresh. There's a lot of them, too. Which means it's either the knights, the thieves, or both. Some of these footprints must be Flynn's. Could be. Hey, over here, hurry up. I see. So first you get us alone in the dark, then you zap us, huh? Hmm, zap. I like the way that sounds. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Why are you smiling like that? Let's try to get along now, okay? Looks like no one's here. No Imperial Knights, Thieves, or anyone else. Maybe they're further in? How far in are we talking here? It doesn't look like anyone's been here, does it? The information about the Underground couldn't have gotten out, could it? The Underground? Recently, an entrance to an Underground area was uncovered here. A handful of mages are supposed to be the only people who know about it. But it's okay for us to know this? 
I don't have much choice if I'm to clear my name, do I? Clear your name, huh? The ground is scratched here. It's not like I would have minded letting the thieves have the ruins above ground after we finished the excavation, but it's a good thing we came here when we did. Well then, we'd better hurry up and follow them. All we have to do is move this? <gasps> Come on, you have to put your shoulder into it. Um, right. Come on, just a little more. Carol, are you okay? Sure, yeah, that was a cinch. <sighs> okay, here we go. This is my first time going inside ruins. Be careful over there, it's slippery. What are you looking at? I was just surprised. You're actually a nice person. Oh, I knew it would be a pain to bring you along. I should have just come by myself. Do you always come to research these ruins alone? Yeah. Aren't you afraid you'll get hurt by monsters or traps? There are always risks if you're trying to actually do something. If someone gets hurt, it's an acceptable loss. Even if you're the one who gets hurt? Yeah. Don't you ever worry or hesitate? Worrying about getting what you want without anyone getting hurt? You've had a pretty easy life. An easy life? And Blastia will never betray me, so they're easy to deal with. Rita's amazing. She just comes right out and says what she has to say. She knows exactly what's important to her. I wish I knew what was important to me. Just travel around for a while. You'll figure it out. These ruins feel very different once you're inside them. Yeah, it's weird. And there's all this stuff I've never seen before. What, is this your first time too, Carol? Well, yeah. My specialty's monster hunting. Hey, what do you think this is? You really shouldn't be fooling around over there. This place is loaded with traps. Did anyone else just hear a click? Carol, watch out! Ah! Sorry, I thought you were about to get killed. I overdid it. I think I would have been better off getting caught in the trap. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Oh, I... Looks like this little one is no good. Wow. So this is what Blastia looked like before... I wonder why ancient people buried Blastia in ruins like this in the first place. I wish I could tell you. That's something else being researched. With all these Blastia here, I don't suppose there are any Aqua Blastia lying around too. None of them have cores in them. Really? Then they don't work, do they? Blastia aren't excavated with the cores and the bodies together. Cores produce magic through formulas. Bodies control that magic. The two combined are referred to as Blastia. Each Blastia possesses different attributes and is marked by a crest that indicates those attributes. With current technology, Blastia bodies can be manufactured, but the production of Blastia cores is impossible. So basically, cores are very valuable since they have to be excavated. It's only natural that thieves would want to steal them. That's not quite true. It seems Estelisa's information is a little outdated. What's outdated about it? There's some degradation of quality, but there's been some success in the synthesis of simple Blastia cores. Really? That's why I wouldn't do anything stupid, like go stealing people's cores. If I had time to waste doing things like that, I'd rather be spending it researching better ways to completely restore incomplete or degraded cores. That's what being a mage is all about. 
A noble creed, but that doesn't clear your name. Yes, talk is cheap, I suppose. Perhaps there are still some Blastia left that can be used. This one's still got a core in it! Here, try shooting this at the core. This ring set with something that looks just like a Blastia core. Glyph crystallization of a formula allows this Blastia to emit air as needed. That's not quite the best way to put it. It's actually used to charge other Blastia with air. But wait, how did you know that? In the castle, I read that the ring acts as a kind of key in ancient ruins. Castle? So all I do is point? Just aim the sorcerer's ring at the core of that Blastia. Face your target, and shoot. There's a limit to its range, though. Go on, try it. That's all it takes. That's a Strim Crest. It's a mark that indicates movement. Huh. Interesting. Sentinel for taking care of unwanted guests. Okay then, keep your eyes open and let's keep moving. Are you sure? What if I'm just luring you deeper into the ruins so I can zap you? I'm starting to think I'd rather try my luck with the golem. Here, you take it. Isn't this thing important or something? We'll need to use it a few more times. Okay, I guess I'd better hold it since I'm leading the way. I wonder if people a long time ago used little rings like this to move things around. Yes, items like this have been discovered in other ruins as well. It sure is useful for something so small. Yeah, unlike some people I could name. Huh? It's impressive that you've been entrusted with a sorcerer's ring, Rita. I've heard they're only given to a very small number of people. Huh, <laughs> guess someone trusts you. You're the only one who doesn't. Guess we can do this. That was easy. It looks like they've messed up our order. Let's take them down. Uh, what the? I was leading up the rear of the party and now I'm in front? From behind? Oh man. We can still overcome this. Think you can beat us with an ambush? Uh, monsters don't think. That was scary. I didn't expect to be ambushed from behind like that. Well, I guess we just can't ever let our guard down where there are monsters about. If they attack from the rear, any of us could get pulled into battle. Right. Let's be careful and hope that doesn't happen again. Hmm. This only happens with a preemptive attack. Preemptive attacks, huh? What? You guys! It's back! Hit it with what I gave you just now! Huh? You mean with this? Do it now! Leave it to me! <laughs> this? Nah, this isn't scary! You hey! I get it now, so that's how it I didn't know it could be used like... Right, let's get... Hey, didn't you say something about the castle not too long ago? Oh? Yes, well, you see... Yeah, I was in the castle a while back. I used to be a knight. You? A knight? Please, how gullible do you think I am? Believe it or not, it's true. Will wonders never cease? Is it really so hard for everyone to believe that? Come on, let's go. Hey, they changed the subject on me. Yeah! Easy. 
easy win. Guess we can do this. Yeah, I beat you in the next one. Let's get this over with. All right, who's next? That was easy. Was easy. I feel hey. Jeez, what is this thing? So this is a blastia too? But what I want is the aqua blastia, not this this puppet. What are you doing? Don't just go poking at him like that. If I can just analyze him, I'll finally be able to complete my anima formula. Huh? No, his Blastia core is missing. Rita, looks like one of your friends is here. Hey, 
Who are you? M me? I'm just a Blastia researcher from Ospio. That sounded convincing. And just who are all of you? This place is off limits, you know. I think you just gave yourself away. I don't know who you are, but you're definitely not from Ospio if you don't recognize me. Guess she's got no problems with modesty. Yeah, this job is just full of problems. If it's not the Knights, it's a bunch of kids. To heal your wounds. Hey, you guys! Stop playing around and help us! Ugh. All right, all right. I'm going after that idiot. You all take care of this. What do you mean you'll leave it to us? How are you going to get through? Oh, that idiot! I guess we've got no choice but to play with this wind-up toy for now. Let's get this over with and go after that jerk. I can't believe this thing's moving! Can we really defeat something this big? Please, be still! I don't think this thing's gonna listen. Well, well I just thought... A sword works better on crazy things like this. I don't know if I can bring myself to... We gotta teach him a lesson. Yuri, was that the person you were chasing? Let's go chase him down. Oh man, no break? Hey, I learned something. All that's left is to cut off its power supply. I'm sorry. Rita, hurry! All right, all right! Come on, let's go! But Flynn... There can't be many knights here if our shady friend in the cloak is just wandering around. So you think Flynn is... I don't think he's here anymore. Come on! If I just had a little more time, I could have figured out the Anima formula. Is that why we were fighting that thing? Of course. You suck! You were already here looking for the thief. I just had you guys help out a little. Let's go, let's go. was easy.
Yeah, easy win. I just... collapsed, we'd be buried alive. What are you saying stuff like that for, Estelle? What if that really happened? Come on, don't be such a wimp. These ruins are made of stronger stuff than that. Ah! Estelle! Now the ceiling's gonna collapse because you were talking about it! Huh? No, oh, sorry, I just stubbed my toe on a rock. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Yuri, you're mean. Come on! Let's hurry and finish up what we're doing so we can get out of these ruins. Next week. Next week? Oh! I How can he just steal the core and walk off like that? Ah! Stop! Make him stop! I've only been hired to do a job. I was told to get a good price for any blast of cores I could find. You stole cores from the Imperial Capital too, didn't you? The Capital? No way! Not me! Then maybe it was one of your friends. Yeah, it's that Crete the Decky. Where'd he run off to? He's probably picking up his money from the client right now. Client, huh? And who exactly might that be? All I know is he's somewhere in Torum Harbor. I, I don't know any more than that. He was a huge bruiser of a guy with a scar on his right cheek and one eye missing. So is this the guy collecting all the cores? And where did you steal that sorcerer's ring? Wh who says I stole it? The client gave it to me, said it would be useful for this job. Liar. That's not something the boss of some pickpockets could get a- uh, Honest, you gotta believe me. This thing sounds pretty big. You think somebody important is behind it all? I think you're on the right track, Captain Carroll. This doesn't sound like some ordinary band of thieves. Man, first the knights, then the monsters, now this. Knight? Then Flynn was here after all. Yeah, that's him. That damn knight. Shut up! Great, Rita. You knocked him out. Now what? I'll have the city guards come pick him up later. All right, then. Let's get back to Ospio. Oh, man. All right, all right. Wonderful! That was easy.
so many. We'll get every last one. It'll be a hundred years before you can be. So Flynn wasn't in there either. So who is this knight exactly? He's Yuri's friend. Hmm, your friend? That must be a pain. Huh? Never mind. So what brings him to this town? He was looking for a mage to repair Halur's barrier blastia. Oh, that rookie. He came to see me too. Flynn did? Was he all right? Yeah, I guess. You guess? Well, since he's a knight, I'm sure he got some mage or another to help. Maybe he's already back in Halur. Oh, no. Well, do you trust me yet? I don't think Reed is the sort of person to steal. Vouch for her character all you like, but that doesn't prove her innocent. But... Don't bother trying to make him believe me. But I really didn't do it, you know. <laughs> well, I guess research seems to fit you better than robbery. Yuri isn't very good at expressing his feelings. What a weirdo. I'm gonna go let the city guards know about what happened. Go and wait for me in my lab. I don't think those stubborn guards will let us pass through the entrance. True. Then take this with you. Show this to the guard and they should let you through. Thanks. Got it? Don't leave town without my permission, or you'll be sorry. It's a good thing the core thief you're chasing turned out not to be Rita, right, Yuri? <laughs> How do you figure that? I couldn't care less who the core thief was. I would have loved it if it were Rita. I'd be done by now. I wouldn't let her hear you say that. Well, at least we got a lead for catching the real criminal. I can't complain about that. If you're that worried about Flynn, would you rather leave now? It's just... I've got to say a proper goodbye to Rita. Then take it easy. What are you going to do after this, Yuri? I guess I'll go pay a visit to the guy behind all this core stealing. It sounds like Dedeki ended up going to the same place, too. In that case, we should make a beeline for Nor Harbor! Didn't he say Torum Harbor? Oh, right. You don't know. Don't know what? Nor and Torum are both ports of a city that extend across two different continents. On the Elikian side, where we are now, is the port of Capua Nor. People call it Nor Harbor. Capua Torum is the port on the other side, on the Tolbikian continent. It's usually just called Torum Harbor. So first we'll go to Nor Harbor. We'll have to pass by Emmied Hill on the way, but it's not that far west from here. I'll be going back to Halur. I still need to follow Flynn. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I'll head back to Halur, too. Huh? Why? How can you just say that? The thief's gonna get away! There's no reason to panic. According to our friend in the ruins, it sounds like his client's base there. Besides, if we're going west, that'll take us close to Halur. Oh, man! But I... 
You gotta be somewhere? A sick girlfriend with an incurable disease or something? Man, if only she really was a frail girl like that. I know I asked you to wait for me, but you sure made yourselves at home, didn't you? Oh, welcome back. What ended up happening to the thief? He's probably crying quietly to himself in his cell by now. Sorry for suspecting you. <laughs> what a heartfelt apology. I'll take it, though. It worked out pretty well for me, too. Rita? Well, thanks for the hospitality. What? Going so soon? We don't want to overstay our welcome. Plus, we're in a bit of a hurry. I'm so happy to have met you, Rita. I'm afraid we have to go now. I'll thank you properly later. Okay. So tell me about this frail girlfriend of yours, Carol. What? The reason you want to go to Nor Harper is so you can see her, isn't it? H how do you know about her? I knew it! No! I mean, she's not even in Nor Harbor. Oh, it's not Nor Harbor? I, I don't know what you're talking about. You might as well come clean, Carol. It's obvious Estelle's not going to give up. You've got it all wrong! Carol! If you're seeing us off, we'll say goodbye here. I'm going with you. You're doing what? Oh, so this is why you told us not to leave without saying goodbye, huh? Yeah. Is that it? Just yeah? Can you just leave like that? You're an important mage here, right? Hmm. I want to see Halur's barrier Blastia for myself. It's no good to the people if it's broken, right? Actually, the three of us fixed it together! Huh? What do you mean you fixed it? You're just amateurs. You know, we revived it! It was great! Let's just say Estelle... it was beginner's luck. Now I'm really worried. I'll have to go see if it's been done properly or... Suit yourself. What? I've never had a real friend my own age before. I'm not so sure. This is gonna be so much fun. Yeah. When we left the capital, it was just me, Repeat, and Estelle. Now Carol and Rita have joined us. I'm so happy to have more people to travel with. I'm not so sure about some people in our party, though. I'm not so sure about you, you little runt. Hey, now. Go easy on the young captain. Rita, we all have to work to get along, okay? Oh, yeah. Right. the knight said. Um, do you mean Flynn? Unfortunately, you just missed him. No way! Not again! He was quite surprised that the barrier had been fixed. Um, would you happen to know which way he went? N no, I I'm sorry. I, I don't know. However, he did entrust me with a letter. I guess I made a little too much mischief. What kind of mischief gets you into this? It's my fault. Oh, come on. Only 5,000 gold? That's way too high for just breaking out of jail. You must have done something else. So, what does the letter say? 
I'm going to Nor Harbor. Catch up with me. Catch up with me, huh? Easy for him to say. He also writes that we should watch out for Assassin. Well, he even knows we're being hunted. Sounds like this guy knows what he's doing. Looks like we have some dangerous people after us now. What are you gonna do? Well, um... I'm going to go to Nor Harbor. I could pass on a message for you if you want. But... I... Think about what you want to do. I'm gonna go make sure Rita isn't causing too much trouble. are in full bloom even though it's not the season for it and the barriers strong too did Estelise really do this what do you mean Carol let it slip when we were leaving Ospio you tried to change the subject but it was too late guess I blew that one we may just have nothing even remotely like she has so you just decided to come with us to eliminate the competition <laughs> don't be ridiculous I have a formula that I have to work out a formula? What do you mean? It's nothing. Forget about it. So what did you want? You came here for something, right? Well, that just took care of about half of it. So, what's the other half? You said that it's easy working with Blastia because they never betray you. Yeah, so... You and Estelle are both human. You're not Blastia. Oh, I get it. You're worried for her. Worried I might hurt her. Estelle's honest. Good. Unlike you or me. I'm just saying, don't do anything reckless. Come on, let's go back. Carol and Estelle are waiting for us. I finally found the clue I was looking for. I want to be all kinds of reckless. Wow, I've never seen this many flowers on Halur's tree before. Huh? Doesn't it always get like that when the flowers are in season? In season or out. I've never seen all the buds blooming at once like this. Really? Guess we're lucky to get to see something so amazing. I'd say it's more abnormal than amazing. us while you can I say we've come to courteously escort you back to the capital and then we can clamp Yuri in chains where he belongs I've been waiting for you Yuri lol don't you move a muscle jeez this guy never lets up does he an old acquaintance you may be but today I can overlook your transgressions no longer Yuri isn't a bad person. I asked him to go with me. Yeah, Yuri, you ruffian! You're coercing Lady Astelis! No, this is what I really want. I'll go back to the castle. Just leave me be for a little longer. I cannot allow that. Return to the castle with us. I can't go back. Please understand this. We have no choice. We'll have to apprehend the criminal as well. Your freedom goodbye, for it ends today. I say, prepare to face the Imperial Knight's ultimate fighting art, the Overlimit. The Overlimit doesn't belong to the Knights. Anyone can do it last time I... I say be quiet! Yuri, what's an Overlimit? It's a technique to increase your abilities while fighting. How do you do it again? You fool! How could you forget something like that? I say I shall jog your memory, but after that... I say I shall give you a non-stop ticket on the train of death! First, attack! Curse you! Yeah! Attack! Attack! Alright, you attack the enemy and that raises your battle spirit. Blast! Your hits are not connecting at all! Ah. Ah. 
much. I say that hurt. Cannot I say stand this any longer? Oh yeah, your battle spirit goes up if you're attacked too. All right, and then if you release the battle spirit that you've stored up, I'll blow you away! No, no, I'm full, thank you. That's enough for today. Wow! Yuri, that's amazing! We mustn't let his power charge up anymore! I've got you just where I want you. Alright. Star Star! <laughs> Wonderful! Nice work, men. I'm sorry. I can't go back. Ugh. What a shame. Uh, Rita! She says she's not going back, so get lost. Yuri! It's them again! Damn it! I knew they were still after us. What is it this time? W what do you mean? I'll explain later. Carol, which way is Nor Harbor? Uh, uh, it's west! West! You go over a meat hill, and Capua Nor is right there! All right, let's go now then. But I can't. Ah, uh, make a decision. Which do you really want to do? Keep traveling with us or go home? I'm going to keep traveling. A wise choice, and one that those knights surely wouldn't be able to agree with. Imperial Knight Point One. With this sword, I shall protect the people, wasn't it? Indeed! Come on, boys! Let's show them what the Imperial Knights are made of! I'm sorry. Isn't it hard to use a weapon that large, Carol? It's a little heavy, but I need to hold something large like this to make myself look bigger. That's just the right trick to hide your minuscule size. Ah, you want to look bigger to fool the enemies. Now that you mention it, small monsters often puff themselves up to appear more menacing. Right, it's just like... Huh? Are you saying I'm the same as a monster? Even so, changing your appearance doesn't change who you really are, Carol. Are you dangerous? Tell us right now if you are. It's okay. I'm an elite hunting blade. There's nothing to worry about. I hope that's not another one of your clever tricks. 